fish on the road. Now, I'm returning to the other side, too. But before I leave, I want to ask you something. Naruto and Sasuke. After fighting my mother, Kaguya, did your answers change? Mine hasn't. For a very long time, my wish has always been to protect my friends. I see. Ah, that reminds me. What happened to all the people who got hypnotized by the infinite Tsukuyomi? I want to hurry up and save them all! Undoing the Jutsu is a simple thing. With your tailed beast chakra, Naruto, and your Rinnegan, Sasuke, you simply need to make the Ko Seal. Oh, that's surprisingly easy! Sasuke! Yeah. What about you? The answer you gave back then. I don't mind if you free them. But only after... I execute the five Kage while they're still hypnotized. What? Sasuke, are you still planning on getting revenge? Sasuke, what do you want? What do you desire from the end of this battle? I want to know the honest truth. The previous Kage are the ones who created this situation. I'm going to become the Hokage and change the village. And the Hokage you become? What exactly will that Stand in the way of my revolution!
this will finish everything! No, you won't. Kurama and I are gonna stop you! connections with our allies and everyone else including you of course <laughs> now, now I'm all alone. What's wrong? Don't tell me you've given up already. Is it really that easy for you two to sever your connection? It isn't, is it? Just like Obito and me, your connection with Sasuke can't be severed that easily. Remember, you didn't just reconnect Kakashi and me. My heart was so hardened, yet you. And it wasn't just me. You opened up a lot of other people's hearts as well. Enemies. People surrounded by hatred. People who rejected the other villages. People who were hurting inside. Even the tailed beasts. You were even capable of solving the problems of the world itself. Now, there's only one person left. It should be easy for you to save a stubborn friend. Right? Yeah, you'll be fine. Remember that you bear the encouragement of all those people on your shoulders. The connections you...
Just be known as a pitiful loser. Those are your only choices. I'm not gonna be a loser. Or the hero who defeated you. I won't be either. Why? What do you want? Too slow! Ah. Right here! I'm going to beat you here. Just like I did before. You're going to lose. You know that I'm different from how I was back then, don't you? I won't lose anymore! No. So much. You've always been the same. That attitude of yours is not the same. Damn it!
done. Now do you finally get it? <coughs> See? If you move, the wound will open. Why are you so obsessed with standing in my way? I acquired this strength so I could cut everything off and enter the darkness. Naturally, everyone tried to break their bonds with me at least once. But you... You never did. Why are you so determined to stay involved with me? Huh. How many times do I have to tell you? Don't you get it by now? Just answer me! Because we're friends. Ooh, poor big words. Just what is a friend... to you? You can't explain something like that with words. But whenever I see you trying to carry everything on your shoulders like that... It... hurts. It hurts so bad that I just can't ignore you. Naruto. I know that you've always been alone. Just like me, you felt alienated in the village. But unlike me, you did stupid things to try and get people's attention. Back then, I thought you were an idiot. A weakling. But... Deep down inside, I was interested in you, too. Then we both grew and ended up on the same team. I did missions together with you while you kept going on and on about how you wanted to become the Hokage. And as I felt us growing stronger together, I decided that I wanted to fight you someday. Then... I started to see Team Seven as my own family. That's why, whenever I saw you in pain, yes, I also... hurt. When I understood your pain, that's when I first thought of you as a friend. But in return, as I saw you grow exponentially strong, I just couldn't ignore you. You had a strength that I lacked. You were always walking in front of me. Just like my brother did. And the same is true today. You. It's too soon for you to move. Just when I thought I could punch you to wake you up. <laughs> huh? <laughs> what? You still want to keep fighting? Of course, I'll fight you as many times as... I accept it. Huh? I lost. You... You idiot! This isn't about winning or losing! My friend was sulking, so I just thought I'd punch him to wake him up, that's all!
Hey, Naruto. I accept you. If I die here, the chain of war that's been continuing since the time of the Sage of the Six Paths will come to an end. This is another type of revolution. I'll decide this issue myself, once and for all. How can you decide anything by dying? You might as well live on and help me instead, if you're just gonna do that! What I want to do is cooperate with all the shinobi! Including you, of course. Who says everyone else will agree to that? Oh, come on! Go on! Spout some more crap like that! I'll punch you again! There's no telling when I may stand up to defy you again in the future. You won't do this kind of thing anymore! How... can you be sure of that? Don't make me repeat myself! Just what are you? We're friends! Why are you so obsessed with me? Because we're friends! Why are you so determined to stay involved with me? <laughs> How many times do I have to tell you? Don't you get it by now? Just answer me! Come on! You're the one who still doesn't get it. Now that I think about it, I guess you always have been surprisingly dense. Oh, Sasuke's crying. Shut up, you loser. I knew they'd be here. Kakashi-sensei. Yeah, go to them. I'm not gonna lose to you! Say whatever you want, you brain-dead loser. Enough, Naruto! Shut up already! So, he's finally returned. <laughs>